Uh, and the splashes you see going on now, that's the air filter bomb. And as you can see, it is quite devastating. And I should actually change missile pathfinding. Yes, there we go. Welcome back, ladies and people, to Polaris Rebellion again. So, uh, I basically started over, uh, did some different purchases, and didn't use a nuclear blast, so I could sell that off. So, now I have a bit better weapons, and hopefully that will help me to stay alive. I didn't die this time as well. So, uh, yes, I'm not selling these stuff, because apparently there are buttons to switch between them. Uh, just uh, figured it out, and I read the manual again uh, as, as well. It uh, also supports joystick uh, controls. So, sorry on my part, I think I said last episode, or the first episode, so to say, uh, that you couldn't use anything other than a keyboard, but you can use the joystick, you just can't use the mouse. Um, anyway, so I have the air filter now, actually, which is the best bomb. But it also affects uh, air targets, so it's the best bomb you can get, I think. And I also bought the Pathfinder, which is uh, an all-purpose missile, so it affects ground and air targets, so that's the best one I can get as well. Also got another gunner, uh, it's just one gunner, so you can have two, uh, as you can see in the last episode, I guess. I think I had two at some point. Um, I didn't buy any laser munition yet, I got the first one in the first level. But uh, maybe, well, you can, they all have their each bonuses, so it is best to get them all. But in time, we'll get there. Um, so yes, I do want one of the satellites. They are really nice, but I'll show them once I get one of them. Um, and uh, then, yes, the E-reactor, because apparently your shield recharges. I didn't notice that, but it does. Uh, so I really want to get this upgrade as well. And the health packs you can use to increase your shield again, I think. But, sure. um, but uh, yes, that's uh, what I read from the manual anyway. So now we'll have to put that to the test. Let's see how we fare now. Here we go, level 3. Yes, the first laser munition upgrade uh, doubles your uh, firing speed. Uh, the second upgrade increases your power, and the last one does both, or it increases your power mostly, I think. Uh, and the splashes you see going on now, that's the air filter bomb. And as you can see, it is quite devastating. And I should actually change missile pathfinding. Yes, there we go. Because the first missile only affects air targets, the second one only affects ground targets, but Pathfinder does all of it. So that is good. All I have to do now is get another gunner, then uh, satellites, and then I think I'll go for. Uh, oops, the E reactor. So, to recharge your shield faster. Okay, I'm taking quite a few hits. But I can recharge my shield by doing this. Maybe I'm too overpowered for the earlier levels, since I did some uh, good upgrades this time. But I don't care, I like being overpowered. <laughs>
So the big structures I think you can't destroy. And I have my second gunner. Now we're really strong. Oops. So yes, yeah, a structure like this, I don't think even with all this power I can't uh, destroy it. Maybe with a nuclear blast you can, but again, I can sell that for 40,000. So I don't really want to, and I can use that money at the start, so I don't really want to use nuclear blast just to try. If it doesn't work, that's really a waste, so I'm not going to. The score actually is the amount of money you have. So destroying as much as you can is the best way to destroy more. <laughs> As you can see I have 4 ships this time, because I didn't die and I got a life extra, oops, we survived, and that's the end, very good. Um, should I... See, I can buy the munition. I have some uh, nuclear blasts. How many? Two? I don't know. Um, and see the best at least at 250,000 with 8k. I can't get to that. So I'll just buy the laser munitions. One and two. So level 4, here we come. We basically have everything we could want already, except for our satellites. But let's get that for the next level. Here we go.
Look at that, laser munition. So I shouldn't have bought that one then. I could have saved myself 100,000. Well, doesn't matter. I don't really think the gunners are affected by the uh, laser munition upgrades. But well, what can you expect? Almost died because I flew into uh, something. Uh, so I have three nuclear blasts right now, which could give me a hundred and twenty thousand dollars, which should amount to three hundred thousand. Looks like I can buy the ghost from that. Hmm. Tempting. I could also just get eighty thousand and then buy the E reactor. That's seems like a good upgrade as well or get a ghost what do I do well we don't have satellite lead yet and satellites are nice so I'm just going to get the ghosts so goodbye nuclear blasts I'll sell all of you oh I just was short. Um, yeah, I'm going to sell this then for now, because then I will have enough. Even though I'll have to buy it back later, yeah, I can get the ghost now. Yay! So here we go and start level five.
Look at that set lights. This one basically searches for enemies and gets energy from them. So maybe that recharges my shield. Or maybe he just kills them. I don't care, as long as it works. I think it actually does recharge my shield. So then it also functions as a kind of e-reactor, it's ice, just works differently because I assume the e-reactor is a passive thing that just uh, increases your recharging or shield recharge speed, while this one needs to attack enemies to get more energy. Ooh, look at that, another life. So we have five lives now. That is something, or well, maybe there is a cheat to get extra lives as well, I don't know. Let's hope I don't have to cheat.
could that happen? Is that a boss? Help me out, ghost. I've made to do it this correctly, just like I am. Yes. Nice. The gunners just keep on shooting. <laughs> and that is where I'll make an artificial cut because we just finished the first planet and fought that boss and won. So that is a good ending for the episode. And the next episode we'll be visiting a new planet and uh, see what else that has to offer. So thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next week. PA Druze out.